Hey, what's up everybody? Hope you're having a good day. I put out a call for quick tips and I got a really great one from Patrick Larson. So I'm gonna share that with you today. Let's say that we wanna take a cube and we wanna add it to this surface of this arcade model. And this arcade uh, model is free on our website if you'd like it. So let's hit cube and you'll see that it spawns at the axis of the world center here. And we wanna change where it spawns because right now we'd have to move it over. We'd have to kind of try to figure out the rotation to get it in the right spot. You can spend a lot of time doing this kind of moving things around when you're modeling. All right, so we want a quicker way. And the way that we're gonna do that is with all of these work plane options. So right now the work plane, which is this grid here, is set to Y. So if we make a figure, he'll be standing straight up. If we change this to say X and then we make a figure, It'll be laying down on his side and the whole grid has shifted, right? So we wanna change it to spawn an item right at this spot right here. And we can do that with a polygon selection. So let's go to our frame here. Let's go to polygon selection and let's click on this one polygon right here. You can see that I have this selected. All right, so how do we make it so that something spawns on this one spot? We just go back to our work plane options and the bottom one says align work plane to selection. So if we have that selected and then we click this, now the grid is going to kind of shift and rotate. And now if we hit cube, you'll see that it spawns at that exact spot. So then all you have to do is uh, shrink it down, but the rotation, the position, everything's right on that spot. And then if we wanted to put something, say on this screen, we could just go to polygon selection, make sure that one of these polygons here is selected. And then we'll go to our work plane and just click on align work plane to selection. You'll see that the grid snaps and then we'll hit cube and it's gonna pop right into place. And then whenever you're done placing your objects, you just have to go to the work plane options and change it back to Y. And then everything will behave the way that you expect. So it's a really great tip to place things at a specific location, including the rotation. So it's gonna save you a lot of time. Huge shout out to Patrick Larson for sharing this quick tip. I hope you learned something new and we'll talk to you next time. Ciao.